I planned to do things, but then I did different things that kept me from doing the original things, and now I still need to do the original things, so... Parenting isn't about us. In fact, parenting isn't even about our kids. Parenting is just one way Christian dads and moms are to worship God. So welcome to the Truth Love Parent Podcast, where we train dads and moms to give God the preeminence in their parenting. I'm your host, A.M. Brewster, and I'm a nerd. Yes, the ridiculous fact that this episode was published on 2 2 and it's all about our 22nd season brings a loserly joy to my soul. And it's moments like these when I realize why my son is such a dork. With a dad like I, it was unavoidable. But anyway, I'm glad that you're here with me today, and I hope you'll also hang out with me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, and Wisdom. I know you're familiar with Instagram and Facebook and the like, but perhaps you don't know about the ever-growing app called Wisdom. It's a really cool place where you can join me live to talk about parenting and God and whatever else happens to be on the docket for the day. All you have to do is download the app, follow me at AM Brewster, and then join the live conversations. I look forward to your questions, comments, and even the occasional disagreement or a discussion about my leisureliness. In fact, tomorrow we'll be digging even deeper into the idea that parents are a child's most potentially destructive influence. What does that mean? How can you avoid being that destructive influence in the life of your child? Well, feel free to join us on Wisdom Tomorrow. You may also feel free to bring any of your parenting questions or struggles, even if it doesn't have anything to do with the topic. Join me at 11.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on the Wisdom app so that we can help each other worship God better in our parenting. Of course, it doesn't matter where you connect with me on the World Wide Web. I pray I'm a blessing and challenge to you, and I pray that God is exalted in all of our interactions. All right, today's topic is mostly housekeeping. So if this is your first time with us, please know that these types of episodes only come around maybe once every three months or so. This isn't the norm. Of course, season 22 isn't going to be the norm either. Back at the end of November, I announced that I would be taking season 21 off in order to focus my efforts on writing and resource creation. Well, instead of creating new podcast episodes, I was going to repost some past episodes. Well, I did that in December, but then when we got into January, instead of simply reposting the Four Family Love series, I ended up updating the whole series and re-recording it from scratch. Oh, well, I'm glad I did it, but the uh, ended up just throwing off my other plans for these two months. So I pray the new Family Love series was a help and blessing for you and your family. That information is so absolutely necessary if our families are ever going to please the Lord the way we should. But working back through the study was just incredibly impactful for me, and I'm glad that I did it. But in order to get back on track with my original goal, I will be taking off season 22, and I've decided to repost episodes that I couldn't repackage even if I wanted to. So I'm going to reshare some of my favorite special guest interviews. Now, don't judge me. I love all of my special guests, and I believe every conversation is sharpening and every resource is valuable. But I had to pick and choose, so I did. If you're new to the show and you haven't heard many of our interviews, I pray this will be so good for you. And if you have been with us for a while, I pray that re-listening to these conversations will continue to instruct, reprove, correct, and train you. And speaking of special guests, I very badly want to start interviewing new guests in the near future. I took a break for really one reason. We were displaced from our original studio space and were unable to procure one we could afford. I was praying that God would transition us to a new studio and keep the interviews flowing, but that just hasn't been his plan. Right now, Team TLP and I are trying to figure out the best way to proceed, but I'm hoping that the Lord will provide a new studio space sometime soon. We have some awesome authors, creators, products, and services that we're so excited to introduce to you guys. We think they're going to be amazing tools. And I also want to get back to our awesome giveaways. The TLP giveaways are a highlight of our active listeners, and so many of our listeners have won so many amazing free resources. In fact, we've given away hundreds of dollars of books, DVDs, and technology, and I want to break the $1,000 mark sometime soon. What better way is there to invest than in you guys, the dads and moms who want to worship God in their parenting? I personally can't think of a better way. So that is the plan for season 22. I'm going to dig back into some of our oldest interviews and work through to some of my favorite new interviews, the first of which will be from the one special guest who has appeared on the show more times than anyone else. Maybe you know who that is, and maybe you don't. Regardless, please join us next time for a really important conversation about keeping your kids on God's side. And if you or your family need some personalized guidance and how you can get on and stay on God's side, please email us at counselor at truthloveparent.com or call 828-423-0894. 
I hope you're planning to join us next time so we can once again open God's Word to discover how to parent our children for life and godliness. I'll see you then. Truth Love Parent is part of the Evermind Ministries family and is dedicated to helping you worship God through your parenting. So join us next time as we study God's Word to learn how to parent our children for life and godliness. And remember that TLP is a listener-supported ministry. You can visit truthloveparent.com forward slash donate to learn more.